Hi everyone, Quentin here from MeCAD. I wanted to share a great tip for working with library components for board out items that are not manufactured by your company. And what we were saying in the webinar the other day uh, about performance, whenever you've got a lot of round edges and circles and holes, it adds an incredible amount of tessellation to your assembly. It just slows down things unnecessarily. And what, what happens sometimes as well is that we've got all of these parts um, in one body of here and it's completely unnecessary. And uh, we use this as just a reference sometimes. So here is a great tip that you can use for keeping a library component lean and small. So we're gonna use configurations, but I wanna show you a great technique of how we're gonna take this face that we require. So here's an example, I'm gonna take a, a control button on my keyboard and I'm gonna select the faces of this assembly uh, well, not really, it's, it's, a, it's a part actually, but it's, a, it's actually an assembly. I'm just going to take a, a holding control and take some of these faces that I'm going to be using for my uh, my design. So we've just got so tangency there. And now I'm going to go and say file, save as. And this time I'm going to save it as a step file. And what's really interesting about this, when I save this out as a step file, it's going to ask me, do you want to save the bodies or the faces? So I'm going to say just those faces I've selected. Then what I'm going to do, then what I'm going to do is um, go to insert, features, imported. And then I'm going to choose a step file. And this is this clamp library part that I just exported as a step file. So I'm going to be superimposing the surface files with a solid body. So if I click on that surface, they go to the pop up and say hide you will see the surfaces which I've used. Okay, so now I've got the surface bodies on top of the solid bodies. So let's go and hide those and show those. So I'm gonna create a configuration over here called Simplified and say, okay. So in this configuration, I want to suppress all of the solid bodies and in my default configuration it's going to be the obvious default one so what i'm going to do is just go and select all of these solid bodies over here and i'm going to suppress them don't need them and then i'm going to take my surface bodies and just show them so you can see it and then what i do is i go to my configurations and as i swap them you will see both are there that is a really really nice trick for um, re reducing the, the file size.